Trap Boy it look like he anticipating the album coming what out album? soon. I, it looked like I thought I saw that he got an album get ready to drop. Man. Trap Boy? Yeah. Allegedly. That's I thought I saw something today oh, about I don't that. Know. I, and I, that I'm his version and his version of outside is gonna be on the album. On his album. Allegedly. They don't quote me on that one hundred percent, but I swear I read that somewhere. Oh, I don't know. I gotta look into that. I ain't know. I Have you heard it. his version of outside? Nah. Hmm. Have you? I have other than what he played. Man, he was selling it. I ain't. I yeah, tapped into that law when he was selling it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Well, I, I didn't think he made it. block. So huh? I, I, I didn't see it. I'm blocked. Why Trap Boy block you? I, I don't know. But hopefully, Trap Boy, whatever I did, you forgive me, man, and we can sit down and have an interview. But um, but that was dope on a hustle move selling them boys. That's no different than almost selling CDs out the trunk. He came up on some bands on selling that song. Yeah. Um. What about like Blueface version? Outside, uh, it wasn't Mo Three version. I'll say that it was cool. I, I did not like that boy at all. But I was man. Like, that's one of Blueface hardest verses. Man, but I was man, like, I didn't kill that hoe. He said, "Ain't no hood like fatherhood." So that's it. He <laughs> killed that hoe. Father, we father. Kill, <laughs> and that shit though, he sound like he recorded man, it in he the ain't studio. Do it like three though, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of people be saying that uh, the song was gonna be a hit without Mo Three. I don't agree with that because if the song was gonna be a hit, it would have been a hit. Before Mo Three died, we would have been singing outside before Mo Three died, That's and true. we wasn't. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to Bobby song, dope song. You know what I'm saying? But Mo Three definitely elevated that song, elevated in my for opinion. Sure. For you know sure. what I'm saying? I mean, that's why you do features because you take. I mean, Bobby Billions laid down the foundation, so the song gets this. Bobby of Billions him. is a talented artist. Yeah, Bobby sure. Billions is fucking hard. Let's get that clear. He's hard. He on a different level when it comes down to his artistry, but. You know what I'm saying? It's like he's like a acquired taste. Is he signed to Empire too? I don't know if he signed the actual deal to Empire. Okay. I don't know. Who would you like to hear on the uh on the outside remix? I don't want to hear no more outside remixes. I want them to leave it alone. I don't want to hear no more. He's nobody else. You nobody use else. nobody else to touch it. Why? It's that's because you saying Blueface messed it up for everybody. I didn't. You said that. I said I think that's one of Blueface's hardest right. verses. I was. In I said I prefer to listen to Mo 3's version. I was in Detroit this weekend, and my 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 nephew, my godson slash nephew, he was like, "You crazy? Blueface killed that boy." Blueface he, he was, ate that hoe. Man, I was Blueface like, ate. That is one of Blueface's hardest verses. It didn't even sound like he recorded it in the real studio. Man, it doesn't matter. He ate it. Let's next next question, man. But he ain't kill it like Mo Three did. Okay, let's say that. You know we gonna saying? have to dis- disagree. Shout out to Blueface, but we are gonna have to disagree on that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> for sure. 